Hey, it's me. I'm going to do another reading. So let me start with the uh, Prophet Oracle. Let's see what they have to say. So this one says, number 21, be also the peacemakers. Number nine, rejoice tr through all the seasons. And this one says, 16, to you, the earth yields her fruit. Nineteen, the ocean laughs always with the innocent. And 30, let your best be your friend. And yeah. Number four, make not a pot a bond of love. Sounds like pond. 41, sing to me a deeper song. 29, your friend is your needs answered. And 42, come back. Wait, I can't read. Come and be one of us. Hmm. And this one is number 21, soul tree. And number 25, Manifestation. Number seven, Nothing Has Gone Wrong. Thirty-one, Divine Feminine. And 25, Manifestation again. So this is reversed. Hey, I put it wrong. This should be upright. There's only there's only light number thirty. Manifestation. Wait a minute. Hang on. What? Visualize number seventeen. Wellness number twenty four. Soul love number thirty three. Okay. So let let your best be your friend. Okay. And you have a uh, star, number 17, Aquarius, healing and guidance. 
and um, peace. Peace. Abundance. Queen of Pentacles, Taurus. And Manifestation, Page of Pentacles. So the Knight of Pentacles is reversed, so that means that, um, yeah, your intuition is making you, making you go fast. You're healing from heartache. You're being guided in your healing. Whoa, the Empress. And that goes with the divine, the divine Feminine. I saw that card. Number three, Taurus and Libra. And completion, number 21, Capricorn. The world. King of Wands, Aries. Intuition, the moon. Help is coming in. Nine of Swords. That's, Ar that's Archangel Michael. Um, okay, so the Four of Pentacles is upright. So that means that you're holding back. You're not sharing. You're holding back. And the Devil is reversed. Whoa. And that's, to, that's clarifying the world. So when you see the Devil and the world, that's Capricorn. 15 and 21. What? You have the Queen of Wands to clarify the King of Wands. Aries and Leo. I mean, they match their counterparts. The King and Queen of Wands. Burdens have been released. Things will go your way with the Wheel of Fortune. Sagittarius, you're balanced. And you're the prize. So this is all about manifestation, manifesting what you want. Wow. So you have 1010 here. Um, ten and ones reversed, and number ten, the wheel. So there's definitely healing involved and guidance. All right, that's what we're getting. So, um, the prophet is talking about seeing a different, a deeper, deeper song. So, the, okay, number four: make not a bond of love, marriage. So no, no attachments, just connections, no attachments. And four is Aries. And number 29, it adds up to 11. Your friends is your needs answered, friendship. And help is coming in because Archangel Michael is coming in to help. And then there's, um, there's only one light, number 30, which adds up to three, which is the Empress. Look at that. And then you have, you have, oh my God, you have three, three, three. Three, 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 three. Whoa. You have three, 30, and 33. That is insane.
this is about the divine feminine peace and creation abundance so don't make any attachments because that's not love that's codependency so love is about connections not attachment and yeah your friend is the one that you need to help from you need the most so when help is coming in that's the true friend that's someone that's on your side that's someone that supports you there's only one light i mean there's only a light that's the only thing that's real and that's number three the empress number three taurus and libra the divine feminine and there's peace there's soul love and that brings peace and you have a divine number 33 so yeah it's like you're an empress if you're a female and your match is the emperor if you're a male number four so three to four add, the, add up to seven. Oh, look at that you have four here three and four See, number three, the empress. And number four, make not a bond of love. No attachments. So, yeah, um, you're an empress, you're the divine feminine, and your match is emperor, the divine masculine. Three and four. You're being guided and you're healing. You are going to complete this journey. You know the source of negativity, so you also know the source of positivity. You're the Queen of Wands, Queen of Passion, and your match is the King of Wands in Aries. So you have Aries and Leo. And Trust your intuition because your intuition is telling you all this. That is the source of your information. That's the source. <laughs> so trust it. Because what you think could be wrong and what you, what you feel could be wrong, but your intuition is both. It's what you feel and it's what you think. And when they match, that's intuition. That's why it's always right. Having said that, I hope I helped you in some way and I will talk to you again soon.